construction? So the issue with the various types of roof materials that you can get here in Nicaragua um, is obviously the sun is real hot. Thatch roofs are nice because they provide like multiple layers of uh, leaves that have airspace in between and they stay cool. But unless you build in airspace to your roof, then the sun's going to shine on the top of the panel and that heat's going to radiate right through into your living space. So two layers is good and airspace in between is key and then a reflective barrier reflecting that heat back away is great and then if you can create a convection current that pulls cool air um, and blows the hot air out that's the best and that's what I tried to come up with here So it's a uh, double skinned or two layer roof, also known as the cool roof. Um, the idea is to have two layers or more of roof material with an air space in between that creates a hot air convection current that pulls the hot air out of the roof and up through a ridge roof bank. So the main parts are the bottom layer here and it's not necessarily so important what the different materials are but this happens to be a cement board called Plysem and then above that if you can see inside the roof there's a layer of bubble foil a radiant barrier and then there's this spacer which goes above the rafter or alfajia as they call it here and then this spacer that the metal roof panel is screwed to. And so this space in here from the cement board to the roof panel is all open and it's about four plus inches, um, six or eight centimeters. And that's important to let the air pass through. So when this roof is done, there's gonna be a um, eight or 10 inch uh, board across the front of this, blocking all of this off, and then the only space will be up through here, and that's where the cool air will get sucked up through as the air heats in the roof and pulled out through the ridge fan. In order to seal the gap for the air to flow through from the bottom, uh, you need to put some kind of mesh in there, and this is a galvanized fine mesh that keeps out bugs, bees, bats, rats and other things that want to live in that airspace. But the other thing about this uh, metal roof, it's a structural zinc that's been factory painted. Um, we chose white. Uh, white is the color that reflects the most amount of heat. For this type of roof, in theory, you don't have to use white. You could use other colors because the more the roof heats up, the more it sucks air um, from below up through the top. And then up in the roof peak, um, there's a gap between the panel and the crown covering and that's where the air flows out from the top and that's been sealed with a special kind of um, polyester coated uh, fibers that let air pass freely through but keep out rain, dust, and bugs. I have, we haven't seen it done here in Nicaragua, but in theory it should work. It's kind of experimental. It's our first one, but uh, it's already, if you put your hand underneath here, it's, it's, you know, if you were putting your hand on the bottom side of just a roof panel of any kind, metal or nickel or anything you can get here in Nicaragua, that would be super hot. It's hot up there, but it's cool down here. Cool roof.